In a certain calculus class, the ratio of the number of mathematics majors to the number of students who are not mathematics majors is 2 to 5. If two more mathematics majors were to enter the class, the ratio would be 1 to 2. How many students are in the class? So we are going to solve this problem algebraically. We'll have to come up with an equation. So let's see what we mean by ratio first. Okay. So, according to the question, the number of math majors to the number of non-math majors is 2 to 5. Let's erase that. We can hardly see 2 to 5. It's 2 to 5. That's what the question tells me. Now, let's make sure we understand what it means. Now, 2 to 5 ratio means for every two groups of math majors, there are five identical groups of non-math majors. In other words, for every two math majors, there are five non-math majors. But we don't know exactly how many math majors are there. We don't know exactly how many non-math majors are there. But we can certainly assume that each group has x students. So for every two groups of students, each group has x, I'll have five groups of non-math majors. Let me try it once again. For every two groups of math majors, I will have five groups of non-math majors. Since I don't know the group size, I'm going to call it x. In other words, I can say the following. There, are, Suppose there are two x math majors from here and five x non-math majors from here. Alright, now the question also says if two more math majors joined, let's erase the highlights and move on to the next slide. If two more math majors joined, there would be obviously 2x plus 2 math majors. So if currently there are 2x math majors and two more joined, the new number would be 2x plus 2, and the number of non math majors is not changing. We know one thing uh, is the ratio of 2x plus 2 to 5x. Let's write it here. 2x plus 2. Good idea to put princess. To 5x is 1 to 2. We know that. So let's write down our equation on the next slide. Let's erase all this. So basically, this is the equation we have from our previous slide. 2x plus 2 to 5x is 1 to 2. All we need to do is solve this equation, which is not terribly difficult. Okay. Now, 2x plus 2 to 5 is equal to 1 to 2 is just another way of writing the following. Remember, uh, this 2 sign really means 2x plus 2 divided by 5x and 1 to 2 is another way of writing 1 over 2 so we can do that. Now we can cross multiply and multiply 2x plus 2 by 2 like this and then I on the right hand side I multiplied 1 by 5x. Here I distributed 2 over 2x plus 2 I get 4x plus 4. On the right hand side I have 5x times 1 which is 5x. I move the variables on the same side. I have 5x minus 4x on the left hand side and 4 on the right hand side. 5x minus 4x is x, so x is 4. Now if x is 4, that tells me the number of math majors was 2x, but x is 4, it has to be 8. And the number of non-math majors was 5x, since x is 4, has to be 20 and I'm supposed to find the total number of students and that has to be 8 for math majors, 20 for non-math majors. If you add them up, you get 28. So my final answer is 28. Now, let's remember that we have 8 math majors and 20 non-math majors. What we're going to do, we're going to go back and check our answers. So we'll have to remember these two numbers, 8 math majors and 20 non-math majors. So let's erase all this and go back to our preview, the first slide and check if these numbers work out.
Okay, so let's let's write those facts down. Math originally eight, and N stands for non-math majors originally twenty. Okay, now the ratio of eight to twenty is two to five. 8 divided by 4 is 2, 20 divided by 4 is 5. Now if you add in two more math majors, you will have 10 math majors and the ratio of 10 to 20 is 1 to 2. So our answer has to be correct. That's the beauty of doing things algebraically. You can always go back and check your answer and it's always a good idea to check your answer. Once you have the answer right, you know you're, you're fine. So our final answer is we have all together 28 students, 8 of them are math majors and 20 of them are non-math majors. My mouse is acting funny.